Hey guys, you enjoyed the fashion breakdown I did of Jensen Ackles so much, we're gonna continue the series. This week we're gonna do Idris Elba, so stay tuned. So you know Idris Elba from his notable roles as Luther in the BBC series Luther. There's also a movie now that's on Netflix, which I implore you guys to check out. Luther is one of my favorite series ever. Uh, he's been in The Suicide Squad, and he's been in a bunch of other roles. The dude is a great actor. I love watching him. Now, his style, he is a modern day style icon. And we're gonna talk about some of his looks. We're gonna break some of them down, just like we did in the Jensen Ackles video. So now, this first look, I am a huge fan of. It's a classic look. You know, he's gone with a dark suit. He's gone with a shirt and tie that match, but it's a different shade from his suit. So you can really see that it stands out. And you know, he's not breaking any style rules. The fit is good, and if you guys remember, Fit is so important. If your clothes fit, you know, that that's 90% of the battle. But simple shoes, I love the shoes that he's wearing. I love that how it just comes together. The whole outfit is flawless. I love it. I really wish more guys would dress like this on the red carpet. Next up, let's look at one of my favorite looks on this list. This is a dressy casual outfit. If you guys know me and you're longtime followers of the channel, you know I love a good overcoat. I wear them personally in my normal style. He's rocking it here. A nice camel colored overcoat that's mid-length. It looks like it hits above his knee. Um, he's paired it with, looks like a, what's, a light blue, light green. It's kind of hard to tell from here. You guys remember, I'm, I'm a little bit away from the computer screen. Uh, or a pale blue uh, polo shirt and some black pants. It looks nice, a nice casual outfit. Anybody can rock this outfit. Like you guys can really pull this off. I know a lot of guys do not wear overcoats. It's kind of a little bit different, uh, but it's a nice classic look. And I think everybody can really pull it off. I think every guy, no matter what size you are, you could be on the heavier side, on the skinnier side, as long as it fits, you can get a great overcoat and it will look amazing. Okay, I know I said that the last look was one of my favorites, but this one is probably my favorite look of the video, but we're not done yet, so that may change. This look right here is the perfect example of how to dress down a suit. A lot of guys don't know that you can do that. A suit can be dressed up and it can be dressed down. Now. You can make the, the argument that the color already makes it a more casual suit, and that's up to personal preference. It's kind of true, but whatever. But you can do what he's doing with this suit with any color. If you guys take a look, the fit is on point. What I want you to notice is he's wearing a t-shirt. Yes, you can wear a t-shirt with your suit. Now, the thing that you need to remember is you have to have a good t-shirt. You can't pull this off with like a $5 Hanes t-shirt from Walmart or, you know, from Target or something. This has to be like the creme de la creme of t-shirts. You need something that, that you're gonna spend a little bit more money on if you're gonna try to replicate this look. Uh, I recommend Essentials. Now you guys have heard me talk a bunch about Essentials before and that's because I'm a huge fan of them. I'm wearing one of their t-shirts right now. The bamboo cotton hybrid tees are flawless. Nice and soft, very comfortable, but plus they make you look good. It's a high quality t-shirt. I've had this one for years and it looks brand new still. And not to mention, they will be perfect to wear with a suit if you're trying to dress down your suit like we're showing in this picture with Idris Elba here. You guys can't go wrong. The hardest part is Essentials comes in drops. They're not available 24 seven, but they do have a new drop dropping tomorrow. That's right. April 1st, a brand new drop of Essentials is coming. So Saturday at 10 a.m., you gotta make sure, schedule the time, go to Essentials. There'll be a link down in the description, plus a discount code, well-rounded, and it'll save you a little bit of cash on an amazing t-shirt you're gonna have for years to come. So yeah, guys, I do love this look. The only thing I would change is 
it wouldn't have a full break going on with his pants but other than that I do like the look and the, the, the color that's personal preference but all around one of my favorite looks my favorite look so far to be honest in this video now Idris has been known to take some style chances you know some style risks and this suit right here is one of those risks uh, I don't think it really paid off in my personal opinion but uh, again, when it comes to color, color is personal preference, and you gotta think if you are a celebrity that's always on the red carpet, wearing your normal blacks, your blues, your grays, uh, it's gotta get old if you're wearing a suit. So, you know, sometimes you just be daring and, and take chances. It, it's not so much the color that bothers me, it's the pants. Everything else is fine. It's really the pants that, that really get it for me. If you take a look, they don't look like that they're tapered or hemmed properly. They look just a little baggy. It's more of like a straight cut. It, the dude's in shape. He would have been much better off going with a taper uh, on his pants. You know, a slim fit pant, I think looks fantastic with a suit. And that this is definitely a missed style opportunity here. So another look I am really liking is his casual look right here. A, a simple fitted black t-shirt with a pair of you could say that they're gray uh, denim it could be either faded black or gray well you know however you want to look at it um, I love this look I think it's great this is something that I would normally wear myself and you know usually do um, again you're gonna get a great fitting t-shirt if you go with essentials something that if you want to look like this pick up an essentials t-shirt a black one It'll last you forever and it'll look great. Uh, the denim, I think is awesome. You know, it looks to be a little bit more on the skinny side than, than slim, but it's kind of that slim, skinny hybrid. There are so many different kinds of cuts of jeans now. It's not even funny. I think there is like a slim, skinny version out there on the market. But I would recommend if you guys are going with denim, pick like a slim fit denim you're better off going that way than skinny I think skinny jeans you're out for guys that's been out for a very long time try to go with a slim fit but if you can get in a pair that kind of fits like this because it's kind of in between that would work too can't go wrong with it now this outfit here guys is how you rock patterns it's a perfect example perfect blueprint now, I personally don't rock patterns myself. I'm more of a solid guy. My boy Yaya does it much better than I do. But this is how you rock a pattern. Because check out what we have here. We have a gray suit with a black checkered pattern. Awesome, okay? Now, when you want to accentuate that pattern, you want to take one of those colors and match it with either your shirt, your tie, or your pocket square or your other accessories, what have you. And that's exactly what he's done here. He's taken the black tie, the black shirt. He is wearing black socks, black shoes. Um, you can't see it in this picture, but he is. And that brings out the pattern of the suit. It makes it noticeable. It makes it a monochromatic look, but it makes it, it makes it <laughs> layered. Can't speak tonight. It makes it layered. Perfect way to do it. Guys, again, if you're looking for a, like a cheat code or a blueprint on how to rock patterns, this is it. This next outfit looks great. Nice casual outfit. Uh, I love it. It's going dark with it. You know, dark pants. It's going with the leather sneaks. Guys, I would always recommend that you get a pair of shoes like that, a pair of sneakers. Can't go wrong with it. I do want to talk a little bit about the shirt, the Henley. Every guy should have a Henley, at least one. Go with a dark color, you know, black or like what Edris is wearing here in like a navy blue. Can't go wrong with it. The only thing I would change is, you know, unbutton a couple of those buttons. You want to unleash the sexy. There's a reason why the Henley is known as your girlfriend's favorite shirt. Okay, guys, some key points to remember here. Fit is king. Be honest with yourself. It doesn't matter if you've got a little bit of a pudgy belly or if you're a little skinny be honest with yourself visit the tailor okay pay the tailor tax it's so important that your clothes fit you'll feel better you'll get compliments no matter your size be honest with yourself number two remember Idris Elba is 
50 years old. The dude doesn't look 50. I suspect, don't know for certain, that he takes care of his skin. Remember, take care of your skin. Develop a skincare routine. It's so important, okay? And also too, if you wanna try some of these looks that you saw here, and especially the ones that have the elevated t-shirt, you need a elevated t-shirt. Remember Essentials, they drop tomorrow. The discount code is well-rounded. Again, the link and the discount code, it's down in the description, so you guys can't forget. And definitely give them a shot. You guys will love your t-shirts. And they have a whole bunch of other things too, like joggers and uh, heavy sweatshirts and a whole bunch of other products that I'm sure you're gonna love. They've got some new pants coming out, some tanks, and there's some stuff for the Foxy Do That's as well. So be sure to check them out. All right, guys, please be sure to like, subscribe, comment, share, do all the social media things. Help me fight the YouTube algorithm. Ring the bell. Be sure to check out the wellrounderdude.com. Dude 15 will save you 15% off your total purchase, and there's a lot of cool stuff on there, guys. You definitely want to check it out. I also just uploaded a new episode of the podcast. Be sure to check us out. The Wellrounded Dude podcast is available on most of your favorite podcasting platforms you can also listen to it at the wellrounderdude.com so you can just go there and listen to the podcast uh some amazing stuff and i got some cool stuff planned so without further ado we will see you next time guys take care peace